hello friends my name is nikhil nagar and i will provide you the stat pro lectures by which you can model and analyze and design any structure that you want so this is my first lecture so i create a window file and a model file name as model number 1 and you can give the location as per click on browse at desktop name as stat pro work so type is analytical and units we will take in matrix and then create our model तो मैं आप सभी को आज बताऊंगा कि मॉडलिंग वाला पार्ट कैसे करते हैं इन द जोमेट्री पार्ट वी कैन से वी कैन सी मैनी ऑफ द थिंग्स दैट वी हैव टू डू लाइक ग्रिड इन ग्रिड बीम ग्रिड ट्रायंगल प्रेड ग्रिड स्ट्रक्चरल विजार्ट एंड एड बीम्स एंड अदर थिंग्स दैट यू कैन सी एंड वी हैव टू डू आवर मॉडल एज इन दिस प्रोसीजर first we have to do geometry and we have to assign the properties to our geometry elements and assign the materials and there is any specification then we have to provide that supports we have to assign loading we have to apply and then analyze and design as per our suitable code so first of all i create a geometry to main aap sabhi ko bataunga ki isme different operations hain जो हम यूज कर सकते हैं हमारी जोमेट्री को बनाने के लिए तो ग्रिड पे क्लिक करेंगे और बीम ग्रिड को लेंगे तो यहाँ पर एक स्नैप नोड और बीम का लोगो ओपन होगा और यहाँ पर आपको एक विंडो दिखाई देगी विंडो पर आपका ग्रिड बना हुआ मिलेगा आपको तो इसमें हम हमारा बीम बना सकते हैं टैप करके इस पर टैप कर दिया पॉइंट पर फिर सेवन पे गए फिर आगे फाइव पर सिक्स पर तो ऐसे हम कोई भी स्ट्रक्चर बाय द ग्रिड फॉर्मेशन नोट्स देकर कैसा भी स्ट्रक्चर हम चाहे तो बना सकते हैं फिर हमें इस विंडो से बाहर आना है तो हमको एस्केप दबाना पड़ेगा और ग्रिड को जब हटाना है तो यहाँ से क्लोज कर देना तो ग्रिड आपके हट जाएगी और जो आपने स्ट्रक्चर ग्रिड के अंदर बनाया है वो आपको यहाँ शो करेगा विंडो पर सो यू कैन सी ओवर स्ट्रक्चर दैट यू हैव मेड इन यूर जोमेट्री बाय द ग्रिड मैथड तो एग्जाम्पल के लिए अभी हम एक पोर्टल फ्रेम लेते हैं तो अभी हम इसको सेलेक्ट करके डिलीट कर देते हैं एंड क्लिक ऑन यस तो बाय दिस ग्रिड जोमेट्री वी टेक बीम ग्रिड एंड यू कैन चेंज योर डायमेंशन इन दिस ग्रिड टाइप आल्सो बाय क्लिक ऑन एडिट तो एडिट में आपको दिखेगा कि हम प्लेन किस प्लेन में हमारे ग्रिड को इस्टेब्लिश करना चाहते हैं एक्स वाई प्लेन वाई जेड प्लेन देर आर थ्री ऑप्शन and by click on this you can see what is the difference so we take xy plane and angle of plane yy hamara origin hai 0,0,0 0 aur is par click karke hum origin bhi set kar sakte hain to hum 0,0 pe click karke origin choose kar liya uske baad humko grid ki spacing deni hai to hum 0 se leke 10 to number of 10s are grid is there and 10s of vertical lines in also in y direction and the spacing of each spacing is 1 meter so we can change by input in 2 and enter the value like 5 so you can see your change in the grid there are 5 5 meter spacing 10 lines are there number of base are 10 and in x direction there are 2 2 meter spacing 10 number of lines so there are 20 meter and the height is 50 meter of our grid system so now we click on snap node and create our portal frame click on this node go upper and click on this node go upper click on this node and then this now we 
click on escape and enable the grid system click on cross you can change change your view by click on view tab these are the six seven type of views this is isometric view this is your top view this is your bottom view this is your left side view this is your front view this is your right side view and this is your back side so i click on front side view and this is your portal frame if you want to see the what is the height and what is the length of our beam so click double tap on any any geometry and you can check this is the beam number 1 and the length of it is equal to 20 meter and the node 1 and 2 are is in the geometry direction same click on beam structure you can see the length of beam as well as the property that we will assign so if you want to display the dimensions of this structure so click on utilities and beam tools here dimension display dimension and click on display dimension to view and click on display so you can see the dimension of these all beams and columns that in our window if you want to remove it so click on remove and click on remove if you want to see this length only this beam length to so click on the beam and here the dimension to select the beams and click on display display so it will only show the dimension of this beam that you have selected so now we remove this dimension so you can use in this way these tools that are available here same you can choose node tools node to node distance so we have to select two nodes first node is this and second node is this so this it will display the distance between these two nodes is 20 meter that is equal to the height same remove node to node distance it will be removed so now we go to the geometry tab so how so i uh, tell you about i told you about the beam grid now we create this structure by another way so collect select it and delete and click on yes so the second way is add beams but for the add beam operation you have to choose your nodes so we will create node first and then add these beams by the add beam option so first node we take 0,0,0, .0. these are the ordinates of our nodes 0,0,0 .0. And second node at the 20 meter in the x direction, and other two nodes are in y direction. So, so we can select these nodes, but as you can see, these nodes are not selected. So, we have to choose our cursor as per our suitability. So, we click on select, and node cursor is here. So, click on this node cursor and then select these two nodes now we can select it and we will copy this as ctrl c and press ctrl v it's a simple operation that you do in your computer things in daily life ctrl c plus ctrl v for the copy and paste so we will copy these nodes in the y direction with 25 meter height so these nodes are going and paste at the 25 meter heights from the bottom in the y direction plus y direction if you take minus y direction so you have to take minus 25 and click on ok so these nodes are paste below these nodes that you have selected if you want to paste these nodes then ctrl c ctrl v in the upper y direction plus y direction so you have to take the dimension in the positive sign so plus 25 and click on ok so these nodes are paste above these nodes at the 25 meter distance in the y direction 
and the nodes structure has complete and now we joined it by the add beam operation so go to geometry and click on add beam you can join these nodes by click on these nodes one by one click on escape to come out from this command so this is your structure that you have seen before by the grid method and we have created by the add beam method now i will tell you how to insert the nodes in any beam in any column in any line element so if you want ki is beam ke andar hamare char points aur aate hain char node means iske char tukde karna chahte ho if you want to cut in four segments to the this add, this beam so you have to select it and here is the option insert node click on this you can see there are three types of option that you want and is this three that uh, how many points you want to insert in this beam so uh, for example we will take n is equal to 3 and click on add n nodes so these are three nodes that are at 5 meter and then 10 meter and then 15 meter means these three equal segments are created and then click on okay so you can see there are three segments three nodes will be developed and four parts was occur of the of this beam by this way you can divide the beam and columns like we can choose this and click on insert node and use another operation and midpoint so add midpoint say you can create the midpoint of this beam and click on okay this beam divided into two parts and by other option click on this beam and insert node third option is add and points so you choose the proportion just we take 0.2 and click on add new points so it will take 0.2 parts of this length of the beam because the 25 meter meter is the length and proportion is 0.2 that you have entered so 25 multiplied by 0.2 is equal to 5 meter so the node will create at 5 meter now we use 0.4 click on add new point so it will be at 10 meter as well as you can insert there are many of nodes that you want as per the proportion ratio and then click on okay so this column is also divided in three parts this node at 5 meter this node at 10 meter and this is our third segment of the pole and if you want to add so it is the our beam geometry now we check how to assign the plates in our structure so you have to select uh, you have to click on this add plate logo and select two nodes in which you want to give the plates so this is the plate but you can not see it so press on escape and on the window click right click on window and you can see there is 3d rendering option so click on it by 3d rendering you can see your plate that you have formed this is your plate that you establish at this level if you want to select this plate so you have to select the you have to use the plate cursor as well we have to use the node cursor for the node selection so here we use the node cursor select for plate cursor to select this plate so click on plate cursor and select this plate if you want to delete then you can delete by the delete option so in this way we can model our structure by these operations so it is enough for making any structure that you want as per further videos i will provide you how to make buildings how to use 
these six type of logo and other operation that you can see in geometry tab. 